Section 5. How to Assess a Structure In order to provide an accurate representation of the roof and define your estimate, you must start with a good drawing of the footprint of the house. This drawing will be made in the blank space of the upper block of the ROE form. Make your drawing as if you were looking at the property from a hot air balloon. Walk around the house before you start your drawing. If you do not walk around the house, you may miss additions or specific points that require repair. Begin by drawing the footprint of the house. Once you have drawn the footprint, the roof lines will be easy to fill in. Now, hatch line the damaged areas that will need to be covered. Generally, all roofs can be broken into the basic shapes of rectangles and triangles in order to determine the area. Area of a rectangle is measured as length times width. Area of a triangle is measured as length times width divided by 2. When you are using the footprint of the house to calculate the area of coverage, you may need to multiply your equation by a slope factor. A roofing slope calculator may be provided to you. Estimate the blue plastic to extend 2 feet beyond the edges of the damaged area. Estimating the quantity of blue plastic should be completed from the ground. This should be the QA's best estimate of 1. The area of damaged roof that requires coverage to reasonably protect the home and its contents. 2. Quantity of 2x4s measured in linear feet needed to provide temporary repairs to damaged roof structures. 3. Quantity of plywood measured in square feet needed to provide a safe working area. Note, one 4x8 sheet of plywood equals 32 square feet. The preferred method of measuring a roof is to use a tape measure. Always record measurements in feet and round up to the nearest foot. Do not use decimal measurements. In the event that you do not have a tape measure, you can use common references as dimensional aids. Here are some typical reference items. Double garage doors, single garage door, entry door, windows, single, shingles, three tab, shingle height, overlay. Remember, not all roofs are the same front and back. There could easily be two different angles of slope. 